Hey guys, today I kind of just wanted to give y'all an update on how things are going with me, you know, in my personal life and everything, and as far as collecting and all that. Um, you know, I've mentioned in several videos recently that I'm going to be moving, and I just kind of wanted to give you guys an update on that and all that kind of stuff, just kind of let you know where I'm at. Um, we actually have sold our house uh, that we currently live in, and we're supposed to close on it July 31st, so we got about 17 days um, till closing and uh, we've got you know a lot of our stuff already packed up and it's stacked out in our garage and everything um, and we've found a new house um, that we're working towards getting uh, things are looking really good you know we've got inspections done uh, we've got to get our appraisal done and you know some other stuff's got to be taken care of which those of you who've moved know it can be exhausting the whole moving process and phone calls and driving and I mean, it just is very exhausting process, but uh, hopefully, you know, this house, um, we're able to get it. It works out. Things are looking good right now, um, and we're supposed to close on that house on August 10th, which means uh, we're probably going to be uh, living with my mom for about a week and a half to two weeks, somewhere in that range. We've already kind of worked that out, and we'll have to, you know, uh, put our stuff probably in storage or something. We're still trying to figure out all the kinks and everything, but... Um, Really excited. Uh, you know, this new house that, uh, you know, hopefully we're getting. It looks that way. Things are looking good. Um, I'll have my own man cave, my own room to myself, you know, dedicated just to my military stuff. Um, and it's not an enormous room, you know. I mean, it's just going to be like a basic size room. Uh, but I can have it just for my stuff. Whereas, you know, all these years I've had my collection in mine and my wife's bedroom, which, you know, her collection has been in there also. But... Um, she'll actually have a room where she can display her stuff also in this new house um, That way we can kind of keep you know the collection stuff out of our bedroom, which she prefers, you know um, And so I'm real excited, you know to get in there and get moved in and start working on uh, My new man cave my new war room museum, whatever I'm gonna call it, you know, and I'll it'll, it'll take a while But I'll be real excited to share uh, share it with you guys, you know, it's something I've been looking forward to for a long time um I was just going to say, you know, um, I haven't been doing a whole lot of, you know, shooting videos and impressions, you know, a little bit of shooting videos the last couple months, but honestly, where we're at in North Mississippi, it is so hot, which I'm sure in a lot of the other areas where you guys are at, it's hot also, but it is so humid, you know, it's a, it's a different type of heat here than in a lot of other areas, it is so hot, so, you know, if it's, say, 95 degrees, the heat index might be like 108, it is just unbearable, it's so hot to do anything outside, you know. And so hopefully, you know, uh, once things cool down, you know, after a while, uh, it'll probably be another two, three months, then I can do a lot more impressions and shooting videos and other stuff outside because it's just so hot right now. Um, I've, I've also mentioned about my buddy Ray, you know, it's his uncle's land that we shoot on. Um, you know, he's had a lot of back problems and everything. He actually had a nerve block a couple days ago and that went pretty well. Uh, it's his second nerve block. Um, so, you know, I appreciate all you guys' prayers and thoughts and concerns, um, because, you know, if this doesn't help him out, take care of it, you know, he's going to be facing back surgery, and if that happened, he would be down, he's saying six to eight weeks, so it would be probably a month and a half, two months of no shooting or anything, so, but, you know, it's all about what's best for him, you know, the shooting stuff is nowhere near as important as his health, you know, so just continue to pray for him, we appreciate it a lot, um, but, you know, honestly, I was just going to say, as far as, you know, collecting, uh, I mean, there's been basically no gun shows in my area. I mean, my media area. I mean, there's some other areas I could drive, you know, 30, 40 minutes away. But, honestly, those are scarce. It's just, in this area, it just seems like the gun shows, you got to drive two or three hours away, you know. And be kind of bummed out about that, you know. But, hopefully, some more gun shows start getting scheduled here locally and I can start picking up some nice items. Um... And then, you know, as far as antique stores, I've been going to, you know, the same antique stores, which there's a lot of them, but for years, like eight or ten years, like I said, most of them know me by name and why I'm there and everything, and honestly, I've gotten kind of burnt out because most of you guys know you go to antique stores and you see the same old crap for years, and it just sits there and rots. It's almost like it's just a museum, like they don't want to actually sell stuff because they got it so highly priced, you know, they just want to show off their collection in a, in a store, you know. 
And so, you know, it can be real, you know, depressing going to the same stores and seeing stuff, even stuff that you really like, but it's just outrageously priced and they don't want to come off the price, you know, so uh, I'm kind of taking a break from antique stores, you know what I mean, for a while. And plus, I've got all this moving stuff going on anyways. i got plenty to keep me busy. Um, but like, you know, that's really about it. I don't want to make this a lengthy video, but like I said, y'all, if you will, continue to pray for me and my family as far as this whole moving um, process. It can be nerve-wracking, you know, and stressful at times, you know, the, the back and forth and everything. A lot of you know what I'm talking about. But um, hopefully, you know, it all works out and we'll have a nice house for, you know, for our family and make memories with the kids and everything. Um, you know, we've been in this house uh, that we're currently in for eight years and nine months. So, you know, if we stayed here till the end of October, it would be nine years. So we're going to be here the end of July, but, you know, eight years and nine months for our first starter home you know, is really good, because uh, we lived in an apartment for um, a year or so before that, but, um, you know, we're, we're slowly, you know, moving up and everything, and we're, we're, we're blessed and grateful for all we've been, you know, blessed with, you know, but anyways, guys, I'm going to keep it short. Um, like I said, I appreciate you guys' support and your patience and everything. Honestly, these next three or four weeks, I don't know how often I'll be able to make a video, you know, like I said, three or four weeks, month or so, I might only make one or two videos or I might make four or five. You know, I don't know, but I know you guys understand and support me and I appreciate that a lot. And so uh, I'll be getting back to you soon. Thank you.